statistics for graphic display calculator. 3. Scatter plot and regression line. Hi everyone! In this video, we are going to show how to draw scatter plots and regression lines using Casio FX CZ50. Switch on your calculator, pressing AC button. Press the menu button to open the main menu, then move the cursor or press 2 to choose the statistics function. Let's look at the example question for this video. Question. The data represent the speed and the distance needed for a car to come to a full stop. Draw this data on a scatter plot and find the regression line to make a prediction. Let's start entering the data. We will put the speed in list 1. The distance will go in list 2. We will draw the scatter plot with a speed for x axis and distance for y axis. Press F1 to select graph command, then F6 to set up. Press F1 to select start graph 1, then choose graph type scatter, X list list 1. Y list, list 2 and frequency 1. Enter exit to finish setting. Then press F1 to draw the graph. We have drawn the scatter graph. It is possible to change the scale of the X and Y axis. To do this, press Shift then F3 view window and change the scale to 20 for both the x and y axes. Press exit to close the view window, then press F1, then F1 to redraw the graph. Looking at the scatter plot, it shows a relatively strong linear correlation. So let's make an assumption of what the equation of the regression line might be. For the first attempt, we try y equals x. The equation can be entered by pressing F2. Enter y1 equals x, then press F6 to draw. The blue line graph has the equation y equals x. We can change the values of gradient and the y-intercept so that we can get the line closer to the points. Next attempt, we try the equation y equals 5 over 6x minus 20 in y2. Press F6 to draw. We have the second graph shown in red, which shows to be a better fit than blue line. Next, we will let the calculator work out the least square regression line. We will compare our two lines and the regression line done by the calculator. Press F1, calc, then F2, F1 to select AX plus B. The equation of the regression line is y equals 0.768 x minus 13.8. The correlation coefficient is 0.967, which shows a strong positive correlation. We can draw this graph by entering F6. The regression line is close to our second prediction. In order to look for an even better regression, we are changing the regression model next.
Press Shift, then Exit to go back to the screen where we enter the data. Press F1, then F1 to draw the graph. Then press F1 again to display regression command. Select a quadratic regression by pressing F4. The correlation determination for the quadratic model is 0.999, which is better than the linear model. Press F6 to draw this graph. The graph is drawn. Lastly, using this graph, we will predict the stopping distance for a given speed. Press Shift to access the command menu, then select F5 GSOL. Press F1 to choose Y cow and enter 140. Press Execute. The prediction of the stopping distance is 115 meters when a car is moving with a speed of 140 km per hour. In this video, we have shown how to draw scatter plots and regression lines. Graphic Display Calculator, as easy as pie.